Hello everyone, this is Daisy. Welcome to my kitchen. I hope you're all uh, healthy and safe. Um, since we've been in confinement, uh, we haven't been able to go out and do much shopping. And I usually make a trip just to go and get bread in the morning. So I've decided to uh, bake bread at home. And today I've decided to make uh, artisan bread. So for this, you need four cups of uh, white flour and yeast I've got salt and sesame I've also got warm water We will mix, uh, we will put one teaspoon of yeast in a bowl, add one tablespoon of salt, then add very warm two cups of water, we're going to mix this well. Then we'll add the flour gradually. Two. Three. And this is the fourth one. Mix it all together. So this flour is now ready. We're going to put it to rest for two hours. from the spatula yes so I'm just going to put uh, there you go some flour in another tray so we're going to leave some for tomorrow in the refrigerator to, to stand for 24 uh, for overnight 24 uh, for overnight this one will bake today quite sticky. Just fold it back. This is it. Right, we're just going to put it in this tray and leave it for 40 minutes. So guys, um, there, it's been 40 minutes 
since um, I've put this away and uh, the oven has been heating for the past 20 minutes on setting 7. Now I'm just going to prepare this and then we'll uh, put it in the um, oven. So I'll just apply some butter to it. This will just give it a glaze, a shiny glaze. And on top of that we do like butter. Then I'll just sprinkle some sesame seed on it. So I'm just going to use a knife to score it, um, make some cuts so that when it cooks and it gets bigger, it doesn't sort of uh, break. So I'll just go on the side here like that. And then in between here. That's it. With an electric uh, oven, it will be on 450 degrees. Just going to add water, and this will release steam. So it's about one glass of water. This will release steam as it cooks and we'll make the bread crispy and crunchy so just to remind you um, this is on gas mark 8 and it will cook for 30 minutes see you guys this is my artisan bread as you can see it's now ready and it looks beautiful and it's so crunchy so I'm just gonna cut it and serve it now